DJ David blasting the beats and turning on the moves. On the basketball court though, his skills not so smooth. David Chrysophilly was keen to impress at a school for students not in mainstream education. While on the Gold Coast, he met with the family of Jack Beasley, the 17-year-old who was stabbed to death at Surface Paradise five years ago. You're doing a great job out there, mate. Thanks, mate. His death prompted the state Labor government to introduce Jack's law, allowing police to randomly stop and search for weapons. David Chrysophilly is promising he'll make it permanent. To protect young people from knives, from weapons, and Queensland knows that is important. We are proud of this law. It's a Labor law. Their announcement today is that they will keep a Labor law. Stephen Miles was doing a whip through Rockhampton, Merribra and the Sunshine Coast. His focus on health and promises of new bulk billing clinics. Those GP clinics are key to addressing the cost of health care. But it's women's health that has been the focus after the opposition leader finally answered a question on abortion laws he's been dodging for weeks. Do you believe in a woman's right to choose? Well, it probably won't work for his TikTok, but yes. Yeah. Oh, that got you, didn't it? Why'd you vote against yes. it? The question now is what's changed since he voted against decriminalising it in 2018? Yeah, well, that was a decision six years ago, and we are taking a plan to an election that reflects where the laws have been for the last six years, and there'll be no changes. David Christofoli is reluctant to explain why his position on abortion has changed, but it's clear the issue is biting in the community. He might be trying to put the topic behind him. His latest comments have ensured that won't happen. How do you go from staunchly pro-life to suddenly pro-choice just a few days before the election? I think Queensland women will be rightly sceptical. Voters are torn. I mean, abortion to me, as much as I understand like the ladies in general, I just don't support it at all. I think I'm absolutely all for pro-choice. I have two daughters and I absolutely want her to, them to have all the options available to them and for them in charge of their own bodies. I'm no loyalist. I just like people who make sense. Don't we all? Jack Mackay, ABC News, Gold Coast.